Yo, what's going on, guys? It's me, the Bolt of Bear, and we are back with another build. Not a request. We haven't gotten any requests aside from challenges and whatnot, so we're not going to do those quite yet. I might save the challenges for when we hit 1K, but we have a hex build for you today. Not going to use any of the new perks from Dracula, but it is going to be a hex build for the most part. We are going to bring Brutal Strength, and you guys know I love it. I have an addiction to it. But before we get into that, make sure to slap a like on the video and sub if you want to. It does help me, and it helps me understand what you guys want to see more of. And my goal is 1K by the end of the year, and we are so close. We are 40 away, roughly. Um, you guys are amazing. I love each and every one of you guys for supporting the channel. And let's get into the build. First, we have Devour Hope. When a survivor is unhooked at least 24 meters away, Devour Hope receives a token. Two tokens, you gain a 5% haste status effect 10 and 10 seconds after hooking a survivor for a duration of 10 seconds. Three tokens, survivors suffer from the exposed status effect. Five tokens, grants the ability to kill survivors by your own hand. And just in case you don't know, exposed survivors will be down by basic attacks even if uninjured. Haste increases killer movement speed. And then we have Fire Up. Each time the survivors complete repairs on a generator, fire up grows in power. For each generator completed, gain a 4% stackable buff that grants speed bonus for, to picking up, dropping, vaulting, damaging generators, and breaking pallets and breakable walls for the remainder of the trial. Then we have Brutal Strength. Destroy, drop pallets, breakable walls, and generators 20% faster. Of course, it's a staple at this point. Hex Undying. While Hex Undying is active, survivors within 4 meters of any doll totem have their aura revealed. When another Hex Totem would be cleansed, that Totem's Hex transfers to the, the Hex Undying Totem, deactivating Hex Undying. Any tokens the transferred Hex had are transferred as well. And I just realized we have Fire Up and Brutal Strength in here, I, so it's not a full-on Hex build right now, but that we're playing into Devour Hope and Undying. Maybe we'll switch it up for the second match. We'll see if we're even going to include Dracula in this one. So we have add-ons. Ripley's Watch, when a turret removes crawler mode, it is destroyed automatically. And then we have the Obermorph. Uh, the cooldown of crawler mode is 25% faster while outside of tunnels. Hope you guys enjoy. I will see you in the video. Uh, see ya. Alright, these jerks brought me here. They brought me to RPD. What were they thinking? I'm gonna be a menace, dude. I'm not playing nice at all. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, we got... Undying, Devour Hope, Fire Up. Oh, you just chilling? <laughs> fire Up, Devour, and Brutal Strength. Oh my god, nice quick down, dude. Nice quick down. What are we, we're up 30 seconds into the match. You gotta love that. So we'll throw her up on the hook, and then we leave immediately, because uh, I might start running this more often to see how often I can get Devour value out of Xenomorph, because... Now that I think about it, barring it not getting broken immediately, I feel like Devour value might be easy on Xenomorph. These guys are... That's a quick gen, dude. That's a very quick quick gen. Oh, God. He saw this. Maybe. No. Nah, he doesn't see the aura. So he does have balance, though. So. That's unfortunate. I really wish you wouldn't head this way. I really do. All right, you're going to stay in there. I'll go around, come back out. Thank God for leaving. Thank you. Thanks, Trevor. I really appreciate that. You leaving the hook there. I need to get my stack. Oh, my God. They're just focusing gens, man. <laughs> they're just focusing gens. They left her on the hook for two gens. That's not cool. I don't, I don't like teams like that. You know what I do to teams like that? I tunnel. If you're gonna sit, nice, nice dodge. Uh, if you're gonna sit on the on generators while I, uh, while somebody's on the hook and wait till the last possible second to save them, uh, I don't. I feel like, oh, that sucks. I feel like the people getting mad at the killer from be, like being mean at that point are kind of. Um, that's kind of hypocritical. Uh, he's gonna probably pre-drop this, so I'm gonna shoot over. I love it, dude. I freaking love it. I, my brain, dude. My brain is freaking massive. I just know. I know exactly what they're gonna do. These guys can't bully me. I'm the bully, alright? You can't bully me. I'm the bully. 
<laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm not a bully, guys. Please don't cancel me. What are we doing here? What's up, Jeff? We get a nice hit there on Jeff. We'll rotate around here. Oh, you still here, Jeff? Okay, I'll take that. What was that? That hurt my eyes a little bit. Look at him, dude. Look. Just leaving him on hook. Leaving him on hook. Not even care. Not even a care in the world, bro. Not even a care in the world. Just leaving him. I've been in two chases. Oh, thank God. They got to him at the last second. I was like, no. He's going to freaking... All right, so, we, oh my God, dude. Literally just sitting on gens. I, I hate this, I hate it here. I hate it here, guys. Somebody help me, in the comments, somebody help me. <laughs> These guys are wild, man. That's actually, this. a lot of the totem spots that we have right now are pretty bad. Not gonna lie, this one's not great. Oh, I saw somebody. Uh, I got you now, David. <laughs> what are you gonna do here, David? Oh, that's awesome. This is this is. I think this is the one that brought me. Here. If we can still go by that, I don't know. People have, are saying that you can't go by that anymore. So we throw them up, and now we gotta head back because they're not saving again. And I'm not even saying like insta save or nothing. You know, I'm not even saying like insta save. I don't care about that, right? I don't care if you... Okay, what's up? Like, I don't care. I, I, I don't care, like, if you don't insta-save or anything. But if I'm in multiple chases, it pisses me off when Survivor just, like, leave their teammates on the hook for as long as possible. I get it's the most optimal way to play. But then, like, they'll be the same players that will complain that the killer uh, camps or tunnels after that. It's like, guys, what are we doing? Free drop, yep. Uh, this is down, I think. Yeah, we broke this. You're done. You're done, buddy. We'll probably see Undying go here soon. And that's a, what did I say? <laughs> yeah, we'll see Undying go. And then, um, I really hope that that's not Devourer right there. I hear somebody below me, though. Um,. I don't really want to be under him because I'm not going to get my fist stacked. I would love... How far away is she? Damn, she got so far. She got so far in such a small amount of time. Alright, we'll come over this way. We'll see if they're on... Uh... I do hear him. Oh, no. David, you're done. You're done, man. Goodbye, David. Oh, it's getting uh, it's getting censored for YouTube. Getting censored for YouTube. Oh, why did his why did his eyes look so good, dude? It was censored for YouTube for reals. <laughs> All right, what do we got? What do we got here? Uh, they haven't found Devourer, so they're probably terrified right now, dude. We got five stacks. We took somebody out of the game. The game is infinitely uh, closer to being in our favor now. But not, oh, I saw red scratch marks there. I wonder where they could be. Where are you? Mm, not over here. At least I don't think they are. This is like the longest Devourer has ever stayed up in one of my matches. Especially on RPD. <clears throat> Alright, we'll let that break. Um, we might just bloodlust this, right? Ooh, he dead hearted. Ooh, how are you gonna play this? You're very. Like, oh, you're patient, bro. Ah, 
Ah, he got me on that one, dude. He got me on that one. Not Nothing I can do there. Oh, I lost the scratch marks, bro. Oh, my God. I hate this game so much. I lost the scratch marks. I shouldn't have followed him that way. I don't know why I did. Not my game. Hashtag not my game. All right. We're just running. He just doesn't take that. Okay. Oh my god, he's juicing me. He's the juicer of juicer. No, I'm not doing it again. Can't make me. And with that, Jeff is getting a Mori. Are we going to get a full person uh, Zeno Queen Mori spree? I think we are. They're doing gens. They're terrified, bro. Not censored. We don't care. We do not care. <laughs> Alright. Um. What can we do here? Oh, I saw you, Trevor. I saw you. You're freaking... Uh, whatever it is, balance landing won't save you. Won't save you. Oh, we caught him out, dude. We caught him out. You lacking, buddy? Very nice. That was just unfortunate for her that I heard her coming out of the locker. You're done. You're both done. That's a GG's. Get out of my lobby. Don't ever bring me to RPD if you aren't ready for the smoke again. Get on the ground. Now it's you, Trevor. And with that, we have a GG's, guys. GG's. Alright, for the second match, we're only going to change two perks out. We're going to get rid of Fire Up and Devour Hope. And what we're going to replace them with is Hex the Third Seal. Hitting a survivor with a basic attack or a special attack while the Hex Totem is active applies the Blindness status effect. This effect applies to the last four survivors hit. The Hex effect persists as long as a related Hex Totem is standing. And if you don't know what Blindness is, it prevents survivors from seeing auras. And then we have Hex Ruin. All generators are affected by Hex Ruin. While a generator is not being repaired by a survivor, it will immediately and automatically regress repair progress at 100% of the normal regression speed. The Hex effects persist as long as the related Hex Totem is standing. Hope you guys enjoy, and I will see you in the match. Alright, second build, we have Brutal Strength, Undying Ruin, and Hex the Third Seal. Let's see what we can do with this. I'm going to break these early because I hate these uh, buildings. So hopefully that gives us a little bit of time. We'll hop into a tunnel, see if we can't find anybody. Everybody's probably situated already. I'm used to having my semiotic keyboard to know that people have uh, where people are and whatnot. But it is what it is, you know. We found somebody. Not really. That's a terrible totem, man. That's a terrible totem. Oh, but we did. We did find. We found a uh, phone. That's okay. That's good. It's, we did end up finding somebody, so that's not all bad. Okay, nice spin, actually. Okay, that's a much like worse play. I don't know why you did that. Um, can I get her here? Oh, she didn't do that. We're gonna shoot over. Oh my god, we're so good. We're so good at the game. We just do stuff that people don't think of. Nah, that for real. Undying's gone already. Um, for real though, if you got just take some chances, guys. I do see him crouching here. Um, take chances on shots if you think that you can get them. It'll it'll be rewarding for the ones that you do hit. Not so much rewarding for the ones you don't hit. We can't really get a shot off right here because this dude is like hugging those walls tight, man. And I am rather glad that we opened these, opened those doors up. Um, damn, dude, I was hoping to clip him with that. Uh, I think we can get this. Yeah, yeah. We'll break this. 
I saw Fung hanging around, so I'm gonna kind of. Yeah, what's up? You want to get out of my face? Actually, you 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 spin yourself into the worst positions. Yep. All right, we get the hit there. Now we just go pick him up. <clears throat> Another person was hanging out beside me. That's good to know. Uh, probably going to pick her up, too, and throw her up on the hook. I don't think she's that decisive anymore. Wait for it. See if anybody's coming. I don't think anybody's coming. So that's good. We'll pick her up. And we'll take her over to this hook. Now Fung has to actually, like, be careful. Otherwise, she will die. That's why you don't hover. Hovering's bad. Unless you know you can get to save. But I don't... We're going to try and go for Cheryl, because I really don't want to deal with, uh... Let me get the hit there. That's great. Um, she's heading out this way. Which is smart. Is she going to pre-drop? Yep, she's going to pre-drop. Um, that's all right. We, we got broken out there, but that's okay. Oh, she, oh, she's not a mind gamer. I mean, she is a mind gamer. Uh, they got ruined, which is okay. Damn, dude, she really doesn't care. Uh, we'll kick that and get this out of the way, man. Because um, if I was in, if I was in tail mode, that would have been a much easier situation. But we aren't in tail mode, so. But we're about to be. Nice, we got her. We hit her in the foot. Break that. Anybody around me? I hope not. Just Fung. If you're like, if you're around, you're gonna be in a bad spot. All right, so we got three stacks of hex to third seal. So three people are blinded. They can't see like auras or anything like that. Somebody is here. Um, I'm wondering... It's Fung again. Hi, Fung. I missed. I, I pre-shot. Probably shouldn't have pre-shot. We'll fake that. Oh, oh no. Alright. Are they gonna come and try and take, like, body blocks for her, or what? Because she is... She's out of the game. We do get the hit there. She's gotta rotate out. She's probably calling bullshit on every hit that I've gotten on her. Um, it's fine if he wants to take the hit for her. Oh, they got me. I can hear her, though. Alright. And... There's more than one person here. That's okay. Ooh. The flick, bro. The flick. Pick her up, and she is going up on the hook, bud. She's out of the game. She's out of the game, bro. What are you doing? Oh, I heard that. Not getting me with your flashbang. Spun in style, bro. We don't look at explosions. Alright. Ooh, you pre dropping here. I like it, dude, but I'm going to break it. I'm gonna break it. He went this way, I think. Where did you? Oh, you went to the corner. Okay. Well, that's weird. <laughs> the hitbox of the wall overtook his hitbox. That was weird. He's teabagging, but like, he's the one. He's the one that failed, right? Like, they failed in in getting the saves. Like, don't go for all those flashlight saves and whatnot if you if you can't do it, or if you're 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 like obviously playing with somebody that understands that you're going for those, right? <laughs> okay, we fake that. Come around here. Can we fake that? Ooh! We got the hit on him. That's good. That's good. Let's get his ass. Let's get his ass. Ace let himself die. I mean, okay. Well, I don't agree with that hit, but... Ace just being a, being a baby. That's alright. It happens. 
Okay. Alright. Yeah, no! Oh my god, nice. She got a flashlight too. See? Cheryl's competent. Nah, fuck you, I ain't doing that. No. Fuck you, I'm leaving. I ain't hit I'm I'm not, you know what I'm gonna do? If I if I get her down, I'm gonna wait the sixty seconds until it leaves. And then I'm gonna I'm then I'm gonna break it in front of her. I'm gonna break it in front of her so she knows it's a power move, right? It's a power move. Alright, we'll pick her up. Him. We'll pick him up, throw him up on the hook, and we will call it a day. But I'm gonna head over. Oh, that's his first hook. Damn. It's because those two were just flashlight saving, dude. Or trying to. <laughs> Alright, that's still on there. I heard her. I think. I did. I did hear her. No. I'm gonna break this pallet in front of you. Gonna break this one. Throw you on this, and I'm gonna let you watch me go break that other pallet that I didn't. Look at it, it's gone. That's a GG's, guys. GG's. All right, so that second build was probably closer to a hex build than the other one was. Actually, it is closer. It's got three out of uh, four perks instead of two out of four uh, four perks. But you get what I was going for. We got amazing devour value out of the first match. And then we got some, you know, flashlight squads in the second match that didn't entirely like the way we played or something. I'm not quite sure. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to slap a like on the video and sub if you want to. Remember, it does help me understand what you guys want to see more of. And make sure to tell everybody that my goal by the end of the year is 1K. And when we hit 1K, because we will be hitting 1K, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to assemble some of the challenges. So if you guys have any challenges you want to issue me in the uh, comments below, make sure to do that. Let me know what you think. Uh, we'll have a Dracula video coming out wednesday i believe and let me know if you guys want to see the casting of frank stone on this channel if not i'm probably going to upload it to the second channel and if you guys want to watch it it'll be there we will be playing that on release night so if you guys want to see that you can stop over the twitch uh it's twitch.tv slash the bolt the bear no spaces so check it out if you want to make sure to uh stay safe have a wonderful rest of your days night whatever time it is for you and i will see you guys in the next one peace